members of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP in Israel are currently protesting at the Israel seat of power. They said in Jerusalem to demand the unconditional release of their detained leader in Nigeria, Mazi Unamdikanu. The protest, which commenced from All Saints Anglican Church, Tel Aviv, started about some hours to the time of filling this report. Videos shared by iPop Rapture Media on Facebook and YouTube showed members of the group walking peacefully towards the seat of power. The protesters were seen hand with both the Biafran and Israeli flags soliciting the support of the Israeli government in achieving the self-determination of the eastern region. They were heard chanting, Free in Amdekano now, give us Biafra, no more Nigeria, Israeli government, help us speak out, as they carried placards with inscriptions such as Biafran referendum now, I pop ESN is a peaceful movement. They also bought placards containing pictures of young children who were victims of the Nigerian Biafran war, which ravaged the country years ago. Some actions of the protesters were also screaming, Give us Ambazonia. Ambazonia is the name given to the southeastern region of Cameroon. A man who was supposed, you know, supposedly an Israeli government official was seen approaching the protesters to understand their mission. One of the protesters explained that they had come to protest against the incarceration of their leader in the Department of State Service custody in Nigeria. He stated that the Nigerian government and its security agents had killed too many Biafrans over nothing while calling for an end to the insecurity in the region. A female protester further explained that Kanu had simply called for an end to insecurity in the southeast, but he was arrested and had been detained since June, adding that the government and its officials wanted to kill the IPOB leader. Kano was brought to Nigeria from Kenya with the collaborative efforts of the Kenyan authorities and the Nigerian government in controversial circumstances in June 2021. He is facing allegations of treason leveled against him by President Mohamed Buhari's government and has appeared a couple of times before Justice Binta Oyako of the Federal High Court, Abuja. His next court case is slated for January 18, even as his two prominent legal representatives, Ifain Ejofo and Aloy Ejimako, have protested his continued detention at the facility of the Department of State Service DSS, which has denied him his fundamental human rights. What is your thoughts to this? What is your own reaction to this brand development? Who would like you to share the videos via the comment section would like to let us know your own reaction to this. Members of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP in Israel are currently protesting at the Israeli seat of power, Knesset in Jerusalem, to demand an unconditional release of their detained leader in Nigeria, in Amdi Kanun. There have been so many protests both in Nigeria and in diaspora over the release of Mazi Inandikanu, but yet he has remained in custody 
He celebrated his Christmas in custody and his next appearance is on January. What is your thoughts to this? Namdi Kano is to appear in court again before Justice Pinta in Yako. You know, on January 18, even as his two prominent legal representatives, that is, Ifain Ejiofo and Aloy Ijimako, have protested his continued detention at the facility of the DSS, that is the Department of State Service, which has denied him his fundamental human rights. What is your thoughts to this? We would like you to share those with us via the comment section. The protesters in Israel were seen armed with both the Biafran and the Israeli flags, soliciting the support of the Israeli government to, you know, in achieving the self-determination of the Eastern region. Do you think the Israeli government will, you know, help them in this present situation? Do you think they are ready to help in achieving their self-determination? Well, we would like you to let us know your thoughts to this, but before we go, let's see people's reactions and know their thoughts to this. Let's see what people have felt concerning the present situation of things in Nigeria. Ani Emi reacted to this and said, The restoration of Biafra is not negotiable. Zoological Republic called Nigeria can't do anything about that. God bless the public of Biafra restoration. God bless every lovers of freedom all over the world and guide and protect our leader Oyendu. Omadiki, you know, Ohamadiki, pardon, Mazi Inamdikanu, the great unconditional re release. What is your thoughts to this? What is your own reaction to this? We've heard what Amy have said that the restoration of Biafra is non negotiable. No matter what happens, it is not negotiable. What is your own reaction to this? It's time to speak up against oppression, injustice, intimidation, victimization, and wickedness in high places in Nigeria. That is what Bayo Adams have also said. We would like you also to let us know your own reaction to this. We would like you to share your own point of view with us via the comment section. There have been, you know, so many reactions from different people concerning this. And there have been so many, you know, thoughts from different individuals, different group about how to go about the release of Mazenam the Canon. We would like you to let us know your thoughts on this. Do you think the Israeli government are ready to help in achieving the self-determination of which the Biafrans are agitating for? As you can see, they protested in the, they protested in Israeli city of power in Jerusalem over the release, you know, of Kano. We would like you to let us know your thoughts on this. Don't forget that. Still talking about how to free Mazenam the Kano from custody. IPOP members now protest in Israeli city of power, that is in Jerusalem, over Enam the Kano's detention in Nigeria. We would like you to let us know your thoughts on this. Thank you guys for listening. Do subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.